Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you what I got for my birthday. It was my birthday on Saturday, the 4th of June. Um, I turned 19 and I got quite a lot. Plus I went to London for the day, um, Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> So a lot of shopping went on with like birthday money that I got so this is all going to be in this video so keep watching to see what I got. So firstly I'm going to show you what I was gifted. Um, so I got a few little presents but then I did get more money so um, I could go and buy what I wanted but I did get some really lovely presents which I absolutely love. Um, so firstly I'll start off with this. So this is a little sausage dog ring holder and um, as you may know I had a sausage dog called Rosie but unfortunately about two weeks ago we had to put her to sleep um, and that's like the reason why I hadn't been posting um, videos for quite a while because obviously it's obsessing and everything but I'm not going to talk about it anymore because it's making me well up <laughs> but um, yeah so I thought this was so sweet and so thoughtful and um, this was from my dad's girlfriend and it's a sausage dog ring holder so you put all your rings on the tail here and I absolutely love it. Lastly from her I got a new pom pom key ring. I love these and I actually saw this one and I was going to get it um, but I didn't because I've got a burgundy one but it's quite dark for summer and I was actually going to go and get this myself and I can't believe that she got it for me um, yeah I love it then I'm going to move on to what my boyfriend bought me he spoiled me so much I'm so lucky my god everything you got, got me he just knows you too well um, but first I'll start off with these which he got me so he got me some lush things and these are some of my favourite things and then that's something that I haven't actually had before that is like exclusive to the Oxford Street one. Um, so this is the comforter bubble bar. I cannot explain to you how good this smells. I could literally sit here all day sniffing it and what I actually do with these, um, before I use them and like find a time to use them, I put them in my drawers to make my drawers smell good so like every time I open them I get this waft and it's oh my god it just smells so good but um this one I'll open it up. this one it's a bubble bath so basically under hot water you just like grab a bit of the bubble bar you literally don't need that much um you get so many bubbles from it and you just run it under the water so it's quite big um run it under the water and then it creates like loads of bubbles in the bath um, and plus it just smells so heavenly oh my god oh, another bubble bar called Karma um, this is so nice it's like a really relaxing smell um, I don't know what it looks like oh, I don't know oh yeah I can't remember what it looks like but it's like this triangle pyramid and it's just like such a lovely relaxing smell like it's kind of sweet but it's like got undertones of like a relaxing smell I can't explain it but it's oh my god it just smells so good he then got me lava lamp bath bomb and he said that this is like exclusive to the Oxford Street one or something like that and um, so I've never seen this before Let's have a little see what it looks like Ooh. It's like bright orange and there's like purple discs in it. Mm. And this is, it's got like a soapy smell, but it's like kind of sweet as well. But all of Lush stuff I like absolutely love. There are, are like a couple of bath bombs on that, but generally most of them I'm like, mmm, that smells so good. He then got me this. So this is a MAC lipstick in the colour in the colour sin so I had been going on about this for like since Christmas because basically I bought this at Christmas treated myself then I went out on Christmas Eve and I obviously was wearing it and I got home emptied my bag um, I was literally out for like an hour because it was just so rammed where I went and it was ugh um, yeah so I got home after like an hour and I emptied my bag Put everything away and I was like where the hell is that 
and I literally could not find it and I wanted to cry because I literally just bought it, wore it once. Um, so it's this deep red colour, I'll swatch it here. It's such a nice colour. Like, I don't really like bright red colours on me, but this is like a purpley red colour and it's so nice. Next, he got me this perfume. I had recently smelled this perfume, never smelled it before. I, I think it's new, but don't quote me on that. But it's um, Marc Jacobs Daisy in the smell blush, and it's like the Eau de, Eau de Toilette one. So it doesn't last as long as uh, the perfume, Parfum. Um, but they didn't have like, a perfume one of this, but oh my god, it smells so good. I'm going to smell this. Oh, it's just like, it's like summer in a bottle, it just smells so good. If you're ever like in a perfume shop or a Debenhams or a John Lewis or something, if you walk past this, go and smell this. Oh my god, it just smells so good. And then lastly, but my most favourite present that I had, I got this um, year, is the little blue bag <laughs> and the box. So... I actually sent him, because if you go on the Tiffany website and you see something, you can either add it to a wish list or you can hint, you can email it to someone and I was kind of cheeky and I emailed it to him, not thinking that I'd actually get it and I did and oh my god, I love it so much so I've tried to tie it back up like they do it but I can never do it as nice as they do. So it comes in this little box and then the little bag. Then it's a gorgeous Tiffany ring. So I'm not really trying. I don't know if you can see it very well, but on it it says T and Co, and it's like got the date like since they um, have been around. I absolutely love it. It's so simple, but so like pretty. And oh my god, look at it. And it fits like a glove. So now it goes to my necklace, my bracelet, and now I have the ring. And I'm so happy. I love it so much. It's so pretty. So that's everything that I was gifted. Oh no, what's that? What am I lying? So the last couple of things that I was gifted. Um, this by my brother. So this is a scratch map, so basically what it is, it's this huge map of the world and it's like, you know what you get on a scratch card, it's like that stuff. Um, and basically you scratch off where you've been on the world and it's just so good, I've always wanted like a massive one, I've got a little small one but I put it by my bed which is a massive mistake because it's got like all like bits of scratched off from where like my pillows have brushed up against it. Um, but now I have like the huge one and I'm, I'm going to get a frame for it um, and yeah I'm so excited to open this and I just think it's so fun and like you can just remember where you've been when you've looked at it and like where you like want to go and yeah I just love it. The last thing was from my mum um, and it's this little Osprey bag um, and it's just so cute. It's like... Um, I don't, know if, I don't think it would be, this is, it's like fur, um, leopard print, but I don't think it's like real fur, and it's just like a little leather bag from Osprey, and then you've got the inside, you can't really see, the inside there, um, so she just gave me this, um, because she knew I liked it, and then obviously she gave me money as well to get other things. Um, so moving on to that, so that was everything that was gifted, moving on to what I actually bought with my money, so here comes the big, big things. I've been wanting these for a long while but I thought it is so much money for what it is, um, but then I actually like thought about it. Basically they're Bose earphones. Um, and they they were eighty pounds, but then I have had three pairs of the Apple earphones that you get with like the phone, and 
I worked it out, they're £25 a pair and I've had three pairs in like the past year which is ridiculous um, and that cost me £70 so I thought I might as well like invest in a good pair that I know are going to last me like forever um, and they're Bose which is such a good brand like they're such good quality earphones and also um, I bought this in the actual Bose shop on Oxford Street and you get a one year warranty so if they do break for any reason you can just go back to the shop and then they'll like fix it or give you a new pair but I'm so excited to use these I got them in the white colour because I've got a silver phone um, so it goes with like the Apple silver phone and oh my god I'm just so excited to use these next I popped into Aldo and um, so I saw this and I thought it was a clutch bag so I like went to go get it down and then I opened it up and I was like, oh my god, I am in love. So it's this little flowery floral pouch. And then on the back it's the same and it's got the little Aldo, ugh, Aldo sign. And you open it up, it's like an envelope. And then inside it's um, boarding passes, tickets, passport, documents, other. And then like currency, and it's a travel wallet. I know I've already got one, and it's a red one, and it is real leather, and it was forty pound, which is quite a lot. This was only twenty five pound, um, but it's nice to switch it up. So like, I know I'm gonna still use the red one as well, but I just saw this and I couldn't resist. It was so pretty, and I'm in love, and I cannot wait to use this when I next go on my adventure somewhere. Then in Aldo, obviously I've worn these because I went to um, London twice and the first day it, that was when I went into Aldo so I got these sunglasses, how gorgeous are these? they were only £12 and I thought they suited me like quite a lot and I am in love, these are my new favourite sunglasses that I own and they're like a blue reflective and then they've got this white trim around the edge they're so nice and then obviously I thought I need to get a case with them <laughs> so I got this case it's like a shimmery champagne um, beige kind of colour and it's magnetic top so you just slip them in and then magnetic shut if that's even a word <laughs> um, but yeah I'm very happy with those purchases next I got some um, new jeans from Topshop and I haven't bought a pair of new jeans in so long and these are the high waisted Jamie jeans and I don't have a pair of jeans this colour and I have wanted a pair for quite a while so I thought you know what I've got the money so why not treat myself as it's my birthday so these are £40 um, and yeah they are they last forever these the Jamie jeans never fade I've already got a pair of, um, already they don't fade I don't know about the black ones because I don't have a black pair but um, my other colours have not faded whatsoever so yeah I got them um, £36 because they are 40 but I I'm a student still so I got um, £4 off for student discount um, yeah um, they're really soft and so nice and I can't wait to wear them next was a little um, splurge in Starbucks so I went in there look at their tumblers because I've wanted one for quite a while just for juice and put my water in just to make sure that I drink more and then I saw the ice cream one it's like ice cream or like um, the frappes and I couldn't resist this was like £11.95 but oh my god it's so cute but yeah I'm excited to use this the last couple of things um, so I went into Calvin Klein and I bought a pair of underwear so I have the matching sports bra to this so basically it comes in the Calvin Klein bag and then they wrap it up in the tissue I've got the matching sports bra so I thought I might as well get the underwear um, so it's just this with the silver and these are so comfortable they last forever they're 11 pounds um, yeah and they're super soft lastly is a bag and as you can see you can probably guess what the bag is so I used the money from or well, part of the money that my mum gave me for this so 
comes in this bag and then in the tissue paper. Undo it. And then you've got your bag. So I got the um, charcoal, it's like gunmetal I think it's called, um, colour. Because I've got a beigey caramel kind of colour. So I thought I might as well get like a darker one because I have wanted this for a while. I wasn't sure whether to get the smaller size or the bigger size. But I thought, do you know what? I'm just going to get the bigger one for the extra like £7 because I know I'm going to use all that space. <laughs> um, so... Yeah, it's just like another little one to add to my collection and I just love their bags so much. They last forever, they're handmade, um, so obviously that's what you're paying for, because the, they are £65, it's not too bad, but um, obviously some people might find that a bit pricey, but it is handmade, so it's going to last you forever and I think what they said is like, if something happens to it, you take it in store don't need to have the receipt or anything and I think they fix it or you, they give you a new one, something like that. Um, so yeah, it's always handy tonight and I love it. So that was everything that I got for my birthday and bought with my birthday money. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe down below and I will see you next time. Bye!